Uh, we're starting. We're starting to look like a football team, which is good. Uh, you know, early on it's tough getting everybody situated, getting helmets, getting shoulder pads, getting practice jerseys. You know, getting everything to where now it's just football. You know, we're, we're not dealing with paperwork. We're not dealing with any of that stuff. So that's as coaches, it's nice to just settle in. Um, you know, we've been doing a lot of teaching. We've been throwing a lot of stuff at these guys, and uh, I think the first probably two weeks they were overwhelmed. This week you can actually see some stuff starting to sink in a little bit where they're starting to understand what we're talking about and they're understanding why we're doing things and it's not sounding like a foreign language anymore. They're, right. they're speaking our language. Um, and it's funny because football is a, it's its own language. You know, all the terminology and the way we talk to each other, it's, it's, a, it's a foreign language. So when you first hear it for the first time, it's like sitting in a Spanish class and not knowing Spanish. You know, what was this guy talking about? So they're starting to understand the language that we speak and it's starting to make sense, and, and, and they're understanding why we're doing certain things and understanding the scheme, the offensive scheme, the defensive scheme. Um, so I'm happy with it. I noticed today specifically, it's like the intensity starting to ramp up too. You guys are really starting to push the kids at every level. Right. Yeah, and, and we have to because we're, we're you know, two weeks from Saturday is our first game. So um, you kind of have to gradually get there, but you can't wait too long. If you wait till the week before the first game, it's not enough time. So, you know, you, you can't get the first day out and go full bore um, because you might scare some kids away. But you got to understand that, that football is an intense game. And if you don't show up ready to play, somebody's going somebody's gonna to light you up. So, you know, we try to have... Our practice intensity and tempo should be probably harder or, or at a faster pace than what the game's going to be. So that way when you show up on Saturday, things are happening slower than even they are in practice. You know, we try to keep the kids moving, keep them thinking, keep them reacting and reading and, uh, and running and moving. So when they're there on Saturday, it, things slow down a little bit. Um, if we practice at a slower tempo Mondays and Wednesdays, then Saturdays everything's happening at a lot faster pace. So we try to get that intensity with our individual drills with coaches, getting on players, hustling in, hustling out, you know, getting on them a little bit, getting them fired up, kind of getting the the, uh, the adrenaline going because that's how you play on Saturday. So you got to be able to play like that in practice because uh, it can't be it can't be a different experience from Saturday, you know, from practice to game. It's got to be the same. It's got to be the same feeling. A R D.